Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back once again. I know you guys are excited because it is time for another story time with Molt. That's right, guys. So, um, a lot of you guys have been asking for my most embarrassing moment. I don't really know what my most embarrassing moment is, but I do know a couple of very, very embarrassing moments. I'm gonna tell y'all the main one today, and then I might uh, throw another one in the end. All right, so you guys saw the thumbnail, naked in public, right? Uh, so here's the thing. <laughs> in middle school, what was it? Maybe like seventh grade, seventh or eighth grade, something like that. Um, so that was, that's a time in your life where you're still kind of figuring out who you are, you're growing up, you get embarrassed really easily, all this kind of stuff. Um, so <clears throat> I liked this girl, her name was Rachel Dodds, okay? And uh, she went to my school, obviously, and uh, we both kind of liked each other. It, I, I don't know, when you're in middle school, you don't really, I, I don't know. You you know what I'm talking about when you get older, if you're in middle school. But um, when you're in middle school, like you like somebody, and then you like somebody else, and then you like somebody else, then you like somebody else, all this kind of stuff. So I like this girl named Rachel, and um, I would always like, <clears throat> our classes would get out right next to each other. So mine would get out a little earlier, I'd wait, hang out, and talk to her. Uh, so one day I was hanging out after class, getting ready to talk to her and, um, my buddy Coy, his name was Coy, C-O-Y, his name was Coy, very interesting name, uh, was hanging out in the hall with me as well and, uh, Rachel gets out of class so they open it and, uh, she walks out and our doors were like right next to each other so my classroom was right here, her classroom was right here. So I walk out and, uh, or I'm already out. She walks out and I start talking to her. I'm like, hey, what's up? Uh, Rachel, blah, blah, how's class? All this stupid whatever talk that I was trying to do. And my friend Coy comes up and he comes up to pants me, okay? So I'm pretty sure that's something that you guys still do in high school and whatnot. So that's when you pull somebody's pants down and they're just chilling in their boxers in front of everybody. Well, Coy grabbed a little hard, and didn't just only grab my pants, but he grabbed my boxers too. <laughs> so I was standing in front of Rachel, and Koi comes up behind me. I don't even know, and so it's, it's like this, as if I'm looking at y'all like this. He just comes up behind me and whoop, pulls them down. <laughs> I freak out because they go all the way down to my ankles. All Everything's out in the open. Everybody knows all of Malt at this point in time. <laughs> And I freaked out. I didn't really know what to do. I turned super red. I started like laughing. I kind of, I feel like I ran away. I at least went down the hall uh, laughing, just totally embarrassed because like she, there was probably 40 people in the hallway at that point. And I was in the seventh grade. How old are you in the seventh grade? I don't know, like 13 or something. Maybe, no, you're not 13. I don't know, however old you are. You might be 13. Um, totally embarrassed and just freaking like mad at my friend Coy, but he was still my friend, uh, embarrassed in front of Rachel, like <laughs> scared to talk to her for a while, just absolutely ridiculous. So uh, that's probably one of my most embarrassing moments. Uh, and I want to know, uh, A, if that's ever happened to y'all. If it has, let me know down below. Um, and also, let me know what else Y'all might want to hear. I know this one was a little bit shorter. There weren't as many details. I mean, that's pretty much it. I got pants in front of the girl that I liked. But not only pants, underwear too, or boxer too. It was all down. It was all down around my ankles, just like I was chilling. <laughs> Ridiculous. Um, so there's that story. Most embarrassing moment. Um, some other options for you guys for stories. Let's see. I could tell y'all. Why don't y'all ask for a time period in my life for me to tell you stories, okay? So there's college. There's after college, so nowadays. Um, there's, I mean, I guess, I guess y'all can figure it out. High school, middle school, um, young life involved, any of those kinds of things. And then you can say a specific thing. So like uh, your best memory from after college or your scariest moment as a child. That's a good one. I have some pretty, I have some pretty scary stories as well I could tell you guys. Um, so comment those down below. If you see somebody else with the same thing that you wanted to say, so scariest moment say, 
like that like that comment and we'll uh, we'll go down and look through all of those all right but if you guys did enjoy this story time with molt once again i love these guys these are fun for me i love telling you guys stories because y'all can tell that i like i don't know i just like stories i like memories so uh yeah hit that like button if you guys did enjoy and if you're still sticking around uh, let me know if you're a true molt fan and you're still here down in the comments as well and uh yeah We'll see you guys in the next episode. I can't believe that all of these have gotten over 40,000 views. So freaking awesome. I love that. I freaking love that about you guys that y'all like hearing me talk about stories and stuff besides Clash. It's so sweet. So, uh, yeah. Thank you so much for watching, guys. As always, make sure you freaking keep calm and Clash on. I'll see y'all in the next episode. All right? Peace.